gonna start putting this at the beginning of every one of my videos because I get the question so much. What's the wheel and tire size on this truck? The wheels are TIS wheels, if that if you care about that, but they're 22 by 12s, and the tire size is 315 45 R22 Nitto 420Vs. And yeah, I love them. They fit great. They rub a little bit, and I got it reverse leveled, so I had to do some trim work on the front, and that's. What's up, YouTube? This video is going to be on the leaving your EGR hard parts on while deleting your truck. It's something you can do. And it's something a lot of people opt to do is keep your EGR hard parts on while turning it off with a tune. And a lot of people don't know that it's something you can do. So when you go to buy a programmer and a tuner, it gets expensive. You spend $1,200 on a programmer and a tune, and you spend $600 on an exhaust, another $100, $200 on EGR delete, and then you got to have somebody do throw the EGR delete parts on. And that's something I opted to do. I, I trusted myself enough to put the exhaust on and the tune. And and I had the question at first was, can I leave the EGR on while I turn it off with the tuner? And, and yes, you can. A lot of people don't know it. A lot of people do. Maybe you didn't and you had this question. Well, here's a video for you. You can delete your truck and leave the EGR hard parts on. So the EGR delete kit, I have it on now because I mean I've obviously done a lot of work since I've deleted my truck at first and that was over, about a year ago. Delete EGR delete. You put this plate on right here. It blocks off where the EGR comes in to the intake, or whatever. And you got a big EGR cooler right here, and it's all going on my truck, obviously. But and then and that's the second gen swap turbo. It's not something that's going to be on your truck if you're at the, it's the first stage of deleting your fourth gen truck. And uh, yeah, qu a question I see a lot on Facebook forums is, can you delete your exhaust, your D DF, and your muffler and all that stuff, and and turn your EGR off with a tuner? Yes, you can. And here's just me reinstating that fact. And I, I just want to put it out there so maybe I could save people some time and headache and save people annoying people on forums because I know a lot of these older guys that know a lot about trucks. They get so annoyed on these forums, and I'm probably one of the guys that really annoyed them asking stupid questions. And they're like, use the search bar, stupid. This has been asked a million times. People go ask all the time, what oil should I run in my truck? What wheel and tire size? Can I rub this with, uh, run run this 37s without rubbing? And, and that just gets so annoying, seeing that reposted on forums every day. But I turn the notifications off on Facebook forums, so I don't see it all. But it, it gets on people's nerves. But that's just one of the things, yes, you can do that. Don't go on Facebook bugging people about it. Hopefully you see this video first. But here's under the hood of mine. And yeah. Hopefully I can get around to doing more videos like that on things you can do to get around uh, having to retune and, and, and do a bunch of different modern steps and steps you can skip. And that's one of the steps you can skip. I mean, it, it helps to eventually go and get it done just to get it out of the way of the engine bay. If you want your engine bay to look pretty like mine, and maybe mine don't look pretty to you, who cares? I, I think it looks good to me. There's a lot of stuff out of the way, especially the all them EGR parts and that factory ugly turbo and stuff like that and that crankcase ventilation filter is gone and i need to get some more stuff in here i really need to get me a intake horn and uh then i think under the hood will be looking perfect for me but yeah that's one of the steps you can skip go ahead and do it take it for what it is and yeah thanks for watching y'all please subscribe getting on up there and subscribers uh, up there for me is getting close to a thousand that's what i want to get to so i can make some money off this channel and put money in the truck in the channel but thank y'all for watching uh, yeah, y'all have a great day.